been uh, pretty much owned by three swimmers over the last few years. Obviously, Chase Kalish, who won gold in Tokyo. Carson Foster, who was second at the World Championships last summer, third in the world this year. And of course, Jed Lillard, who won the silver medal. They have pretty much had a stranglehold on this event. Jake Foster, solid beginning here in Butterfly. Cooper Lucas, too, from Lakeside Aquatic Club. 17-year-old there, looking good at the outset in lane two. Johnson coming off that double. Easy, though, I shouldn't say easy. Nothing easy in this sport, but the 50 breaststroke. Nice little warm-up, anyway, for him. Going from the 50 to the 400. He and Johnson have the best lifetime time in this event, 413 plus. Lucas trying to build a lead here in lane number two. Foster, his closest pursuer at this point at the international team trials last April in Greensboro, North Carolina. Lucas was 11 in the semifinals there in the 400 IM. Looking to potentially work his way into that last group coming next month in India. Back to Jake and David Johnson once again. And they're in lanes three and four. They're the only two swimmers in this field anyway that were Olympic trial finalists. Foster was fifth, Johnston sixth. Now you're gonna see a little bit of change here now going into this 100 here. Johnson should come back to the field a little bit. He's got a great freestyle, obviously, but watch Jake Foster there in lane number three with the breaststroke. He should start to run this field down here. He's got a tremendous breaststroke, and you can see him already start to go by a couple swimmers right there. Here comes the 22-year-old. Terrific career at Texas, representing Mason Manta Rays, his own club from Ohio. Getting into medical school at Texas, pushed it off a year, gives swimming a, another season plus. And right now, try to track down his Longhorn Aquatics teammate for a few years, David Johnston. 36-2, though, for Johnston, not bad. About seven tenths of a second slower than Foster. I think Foster's going to end up having to go by him here if he's going to have a chance to beat David Johnston because we've already seen what he's been able to do here in freestyle. You mentioned runner-up in the 1500, fourth in the 400, but was right there for second for a while. And this is all right now David Johnston. What a swim for him he's having. Foster still a second behind as they turn here for the freestyle finish. Now those two with some separation on the rest of the field here in this 400 individual medley for the men. Johnston looking excellent. Yeah, Johnston was only three tenths of, actually less than three tenths of a second slower than Foster on that third 50, or pardon me, the second 50 of that breaststroke. And now you look why he is such a great freestyler. He has really extended that lead now. And sort of like Kayla Hahn, who we just saw win as a 14-year-old, doing it in the breaststroke, or excuse me, doing it in the freestyle. Johnson is doing it now. No contest. Yeah, he is cruising his way to victory here. The 400 IM convincing. Wins in a walk here by almost four full seconds over Foster. Nelson in there for third, about four and a half seconds behind the winner, David Johnston. So nice last one, 158 plus on that freestyle leg of that race. And he's happy with that one. Here's the halfway point and he had the lead, but then he thought, well, maybe Foster can get himself back into it. No doubt he did. He ends up finishing second, but way back, four seconds behind David Johnson. 
Just a tremendous swim for this young 21-year-old. A lot of promise for him as we get ready to go to Indy. And he's going to add his name to that list that I mentioned earlier as a, a, a potential guy that could make the team in the 400 IM, certainly in the 400, 800, 1500 freestyles. And David Johnston, after his win, joins us. Congratulations. Been a strong meet, it seems, for you. What's it do for your confidence? Headed to Indy next month. I appreciate it. Um, it does a lot. Um, I was really happy to be out here in Mission Racing. Um, it's very next to my teammate Jake. It was a lot of fun. Um, and I'm just excited to get that win and kind of see where I am. That's what these meets are about. So building steps towards trials. And I know I can be a lot better in five weeks and just really motivated about what's to come. Is there one event that you're really excited for? You've been so solid here in Mission. 400 uh, free, I would say. I've been working a lot on getting my strength up. I was happy with my 500 this year. I'm really looking forward to that one specifically at Trials. Um, but everything, 4 a.m. is actually my favorite race. Every chance I get to race in a final like that gives me a lot of experience and building blocks moving forward. That's a great race. Congratulations. Thank you, Rowdy. Shock the world. Yeah, baby. <laughs> David Johnson looking strong here in the win of the 400 IM. Great race for him. And again, just mash the gas there at the end to win. I